Hello, my crafty loving friends. Welcome to Repurpose My Way. I'm Shelly. Today I have a Michaels haul for you, and uh, I think it's pretty cool because there's a lot of discounted stuff from Christmas. So we're not only going to do Michaels today, I have a small Amazon uh, Dollar Tree haul as well. Uh, something for an upcoming video that I'm going to do, so I thought I'd tell you about it in case you wanted to do it along with me that you would already have the stuff. So I'm going to give you like a little heads up on what you need and uh, you should be good to go if you want to join along with me as I do it. Okay, so the first thing that I have here, the first thing I think I saw that I picked up was these little gift tags. These are the little brown paper gift tags, but these are from Christmas. These were 30 cents a piece. That's how much they were on sale. There's 20 tags in each and you get the little red and white um, uh, tie with it. And I thought these would be great for any time. And I'll tell you what I bought. As I was going along, I found these uh, sign shop tags and there's so many cool ones there. The one that I really like is the thanks. So what I'd like to do is put the thanks on some of these tags and as I sell stuff out of my Etsy shop I can kind of tie these to the product and put it on there and they have a little thank you from me for purchasing uh, one of my creations. So that was my idea. Plus I liked the little thank you milk jug that they have and then there's uh, this little, this little um, IV or stem that they had here. I thought that was really cool. There's a lot of cool things on here um, that I really like. And what I'll do is once um, I'll do a little, I'll open this up and I'll do a little pan of everything that's on there so that you can see. This was, I believe, $4.49 or $4.99. Uh, $4.99. This was not on sale, but it was $4.99 for this. And these, this is a little screen print one. So you put it down, it's got a little screen where you want the paint to go through and you kind of scrape it down over. I'll do a video on it one of these days, maybe with the tags. We can do two and two because that's what I bought it for basically. But it has a little bumblebee and it has a little flower. I don't know, all kinds of really fun stuff on there. So I saw those and I thought these would be perfect to do a video on and to put on my products. Uh, something I needed, and the reason why I went into Michael's, is because I needed some more E6000. Uh, I don't know where my little my little um, tube is, but it's just down to this part right here. I had to cut it down. The back had blown out. Uh, the front had seized up and, and got all dried out because I didn't get the cap on tight enough. And uh, so I'd just been cutting it with scissors and just kind of seeping it out. But I really need a good... E6000 for those things that I really need to glue in very well. So I don't know, the E6000 was $4.99 as well. So $4.99 for that. Uh, I also got these wooden stars. Now these also were from Christmas, but I thought these would be for any time. The ties on them are for any time. It's not like they're red and white like the tags were. Um, and these are a good size and I can do some things with these. I have an idea on some of them and then some of them I just want to grubby them up which is going to be another video that I have coming up um, and use them for some of my decor products to put in them to decorate. So these were again these were Christmas and they were $4.99 marked down to $1.50 a piece. Yeah so $1.50 and you get how many stars in a set? Wow. It says one set. It's supposed to be garland. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you get seven in each, so I got 14 stars. Okay. Now I got another stencil. This one has birds and leaves and uh, birds and, and uh, branches and flowers. And I think maybe leaves too. Yep, leaves too. And again, I'll take it out and we'll do a pan of the whole thing so that you can see it. Um, I have been wanting to do some stuff because spring is coming, even though we're in the middle of winter. Um, spring's coming and I want to do some stuff with, with birds. I love birds. So 
I, I got this, and this was $4.99 as well. This is a stencil. This is not the screen printing kind like the other one that I got. This is an actual stencil. It's all open, and you just uh, stamp the where you want the paint onto your bird or your design. So that was pretty cool. So the other thing that I got is some uh, ribbon. Um, I loved all of these. I got some more of this, not that I needed it, but this was in the Christmas section. It was $9.99, $3, dollars for this little thin uh, thing, but there's quite a bit of, there's 10 yards on there, and I didn't really need it because I have a bunch, but I use a lot of this burlap ribbon, so this is going to be good. And then I got these. These are a little bit thicker. Um, I really like this one. This one's from Christmas as well, but I think it would work anytime. And it's the black and white gingham with the burlap down the middle. And it's not separate. It's all made right in. And this is wired, which I really like. So this was $9.99. So I got that uh, for the $3 as well. So that's a lot. This is 25 feet. So that should do some good projects there. Uh, this one was just in the regular section, but I loved it. I love lace. I'm, I love the lacy stuff with the burlap. I just love those two together. The, the ivory and the burlap, I think, are just so awesome. So I got that, and that was four, uh, that was four ninety nine for three yards. So I think that's going to do quite a bit of stuff. And I know this is in their regular section, so, section, so I really should be able to get um, some more of this. I really like it. Love it. Okay, so another thing that I got for some of my staging and things like that, I got this like weeping willow branch, I guess. I just love it. I thought it was really pretty. I thought it would look nice in some of my decor just hanging out um, or even just, you know, across some different designs um, or some different products and I really like it. And this is just one stem. Um, this was $5.99 and I actually spent $5.99 on this one stem. But again, it's not something that I'm going to sell and even if I was, it would be fine. Um, this is going to be for my staging pretty much. Uh, but I really like it. And I can use it in my decor just in the house if I wanted to until I'm ready to use it for my staging. So I like that. This one I really like too. This is some garland, coiled garland, and this is like a lamb's ear and it's very soft and it's got a little bit of a shine shimmy to it. This was in the Christmas section and it was $14.99 and I got it for $4.50. This is, let's see how long it is. This is a five foot garland. And again, I thought I could use this for staging. Um, maybe use, you know, cut a little bit of it off and use it for uh, other things as well. And I don't, I don't know. I don't really think it has to be for Christmas. Um, it's, it is kind of Christmassy, so it would go there, but I think we might be able to use it for the springtime as well. So I thought, what the hay, I thought it was really pretty. I love the variegated, um, the light green and the little bit of a darker green that's in there. So I thought it was really pretty. So there's that. Then for Michael's haul, last but not least, my moss, my Spanish moss. Uh, I'm almost out of what I have and I normally get it at the Dollar Tree, uh, but they didn't have any when I went last time. So I ordered some on Amazon, which should be coming, and I got a really good deal on it. It was about $3. I bought two for the price of one. I got, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I bought two packages. They came together. I think it was $6 and change. So it was a little over three bucks per package. This one here, and I can't remember the ounces on that. This one here doesn't really say how much is in here. But this is a big package. This is bigger than what I could get at Dollar Tree. I'd have to probably buy 
Um, I'd probably have to buy two or three packages just to make up this one at Dollar Tree. But I like this, and this one I paid up for. This was $9.99. So, but I need it for some of my projects to get stuff on up, up on Etsy. Uh, so it's just one of my things that I need to have. So I, I paid up for it. So I got that. Now stuff that I got off Amazon, I've got some of these uh, timer taper candles. I use these a lot in my crafts as well. And it's a lot cheaper than buying grubbied up already or dipped in silicone wax candles. These are just the, they're kind of like an off white color. They screw down at the bottom. I should have grabbed some batteries. Okay, I went and got some batteries. So it takes two AA batteries. Just slide them right in the bottom. Put your top on there and then voila. So it has more of a white color uh, bulb to it. Some of them have like a, a light soft yellow color um, or a soft white. This one is uh, more white. And uh, I got six of these in the box and I can't remember how much I paid for them but I will look it up and before I post this video I will have it down at the bottom for you. So these are six timer taper candles and I am going to grubby some of these up and if you don't know what that means I on occasion use the spice mix and I put it in this I've had it for a while because as you can tell look at this this uh, Ziploc bag but it smells so good um, this is a spice mix that's got ground coffee instant coffee in it which I got from the Dollar Tree that goes along with my um, with my the rest of my haul for my for Dollar Tree so uh, you get instant ground coffee or you could get beans so I have used vanilla before uh, if you get the beans you just need to have a grinder and grind them up I like the vanilla beans in it too it gives it a different smell they had uh, the instant coffee that was just plain, so that's fine. This adds like a little bit of um, texture to it and color as well. So, and then I also got some pumpkin spice. This is all from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And probably what I'm gonna do is dump, maybe not all of this, but dump all these together in this bag because I am running out and I plan on doing some more grubbying. So I'm going to show you how to put it, make it all up and then grubby some candles. So this one is ground cinnamon. Again, $1. Got it at the Dollar Tree. They didn't have any cloves there and I love the smell of cloves in my, uh, in my mix. So I had some, this one is the organic ground cloves. I won't be using all of these because it's very expensive. Um, and I'll just be using part of it and the smell is strong enough so it should be fine and then I have some cloves that are most of them are whole and I like to use those too again gives it texture and uh, but you don't have to do that if you don't want to so this I got I believe at Walmart and it definitely was not 99 cents but I'm not going to use that whole thing like I said so I'm going to mix those all together in some kind of a container or a bag. I like using the bag because it just makes it easier to get in and out of. Um, and then I got four of these regular candles in the candle section. This one is, these are all vanilla, all four of them, because uh, if any of it scratches off, at least it'll be a nice creamy color underneath if any of the grubby stuff scratches off. So let's see. So you'll need some candles, whatever you decide. We're going to do some of these wax candles. We're going to do some of these battery candles. And all you're going to need is those spices and the coffee and some Mod Podge or some regular white glue, like school glue. And you want to mix that with a little bit of water. And I, if I can find some, I know I have glue around here, so if I can find it, I will mix some up for you and show you that as well. But that'll be on my next video to show you. Uh, and I'm trying to decide whether I want to do a video on it or if I want to do a 
uh, alive and just have a live and do it all in front of you so that you can see it and be able to chat with you guys as well. So maybe down in the comments, let me know, would you like me to do a live on grubbying my candles and showing you how to do it? Or just a video to do a quick show and tell? Just comment down below and let me know. All right, guys, hopefully you liked my Michaels haul, uh, my candles I got from Amazon, and my stuff that I got from the Dollar Tree. And uh, hopefully you'll join me for the next time when we get to grubby candles, and I'll show you how to do that. All right, thanks a lot, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe, and have a great day.